Hey, so uh, my name is Judah Hoover, here with Alan Swanson, a good friend of mine and a friend of the Landlords and Investors Mastermind Group for a while. Alan is going to be our speaker next Thursday night, November 21st at 7 o'clock at the Red Lion Hotel in Harrisburg. So, Alan, um, tell us what is your topic and what are you, what are you speaking on? My topic is going to be business tools that you can use in all aspects of your real estate investing business. And I'm specifically going to look at a property that I flipped earlier this year where I got a check for $77,000 at closing. And I'm going to tell you how I use my business tools to help make that happen. That's awesome. Yeah, I think that I think that what's what's interesting about business tools is how valuable they are because a lot of people they get started in real estate and then they realize, "Oh, I need a lease," or "Oh, I need this," and "Oh, I need that," or they get halfway into a transaction. I just um, was working on something and I've been out of the mortgage industry now for a while and I had to get a mortgage payoff letter because of paying off a private mortgage and things like that and I had to do an official mortgage payoff letter and I didn't have that tool that was on an old hard drive and I just realized, oh shoot, I'm stuck without this. And I was able to go and get it online but business tools are, are really critical and sometimes you don't know what you don't have until you actually need it. That's correct and a lot of mine I took information I got from other people, consolidate all the information to a new tool that I created, and I found it to be a much more effective way for me to use it in my business. And I'm going to try to convey how other people can use those same tools or similar type of tools in their business. Yeah, that's excellent. And just, yeah, and so you say your business, you have a background of both flipping properties. Roughly how many properties have you flipped? I've flipped 34. 34 properties. And I know just from working with you, these are you know, middle to high end houses, you know, these aren't, these aren't, it's not just like you did, um, you know, paint and carpet rehabs on, you know, scummy row homes in the city. You, you've done some really nice flips. And the other thing that I think is impressive that Alan, I've been your friend for what, 10 years. Right. And I didn't realize how many properties did you buy? How quick when you first got in the business? Uh, when I first got into real estate, I bought 22 buy and hold properties in 23 months. 20 rehabbed them and got them all refinanced and people, tenants living in them in 22 months. Yeah, so what's funny about that is like, that was before the Burr method. Like, you know, you, we just called that real estate investing. And now everyone, you know, they, they, they've come up with this term. I remember it was like three years ago, I was, I had to ask somebody, I was like, what's the Burr method? And they were like, oh, you know, buy, rehab, refinance, rent out, repeat. I was like, oh, real estate investing. Got it, like, you know, mm -hmm. there, it's, it was just funny to me that they came up with the term. But yeah, so I, I've known you for however long, 10 years, and I just asked for your bio the other day to send it out to the group, and it was the first time that I had seen you have, to, you, I knew you had a, a big pop and a big start, but you did how many properties again? 22 properties. In they bought? 23 months. Rehabbed, rented out, refinanced. That's, that's crazy. So obviously you can't do that without systems in place. Obviously you can't do that without a whole bunch of tools. Correct. And that's what we're going to be talking about. Um, Alan's a local guy, local right here to central Pennsylvania. I think he brings a wealth of knowledge and information. Thursday, the 21st, Red Lion Hotel. I hope to see you guys there. Thanks very much. This is Judah Hoover with the Landlords and Investors Mastermind Group and my good friend, Alan Swanson.